Hello and good afternoon, I'm Neil from Bath Cars and today's car is the Ford Focus Estate it's the 1.6 uh, ZTEC, this one um, on the X registration, just two owners from new and drives very well indeed it uh, is just about to have um, a couple of new uh, uh, anti-roll bar uh, linkages put into it just to uh, give that front end a little bit of sharpness and uh, it's got a decent bit of history with a cam belt just been done at 105k uh, so it's all good news, it drives well, it's got the alloys and it's in this nice metallic green crystal green colour. Supplied by Ford Thorn of Cardiff and it's got the original plates front and rear and the original tax disc holder as well. So it's uh, it's not looking too bad, there's a few little minor marks about the car. The bumpers are pretty straight and tidy. The only thing really is this door here has got some little minor marks running across the wing and into the door. So it's like a scuffing but uh, it's not uh, it's not that bad really the uh, front has probably been just knocked on the front there you can just see a small amount of scuffing to the front near side corner and then it runs down the arch and uh, it's just a bit of a shame really it would have been pretty immaculate bar for that it drives well it's tidy inside it's got the front fogs does it have a heated front screen uh, no no heated front screen on this one it does have remote locking uh, so you've got uh, a remote key, you just press the button and it opens and closes the door like so. And uh, it does have a remote boot lee, so I'll show you the boot space. There we go. So it's pretty tidy in the boot. It's had some uh, action, but nothing too serious. Uh, baggage covers there, there's a skinny spare wheel in the back there. And uh, all pretty good. Got the rear wash wiper and the high level brake light. And... Uh, there is a decent history to go with it as well, which we'll come to a bit later. But let's just go around the tyre. So it's on alloy wheels. These are 15-inch alloys. That tyre there is about half worn. Uh, drums on the back. Uh, God, blimey, pretty new pads on the front here, virtually new. And not far off new tyre as well. And moving around to this side. Uh, again, a pretty decent tyre. Plenty of tread on there. Pads exactly the same. They've not been long done, those pads. And this tyre here, practically brand new, so you've got no spends to make on the tyres. It's got colour coordinated bumpers and wing mirrors. And uh, let's go and have a look at that uh, documents and servicing. Okay, welcome to the history and documents then for this Ford Focus estate. Uh, V5 shows just uh, two owners from new, uh, both uh, gents. And the car shows as a Ford Focus ZTEC estate. A 1.6, so 1596 cc. Uh, green is the colour. Um, no CO2 rating on this one, so this one will be, uh, I think, about 120 odd pounds for six months tax. Now we can tax it at the local post office. Uh, it's just a quick uh, journey up there, and we can use our trade insurance. So don't have to worry about uh, insuring the car to uh, to tax it. But obviously, uh, you need road risk insurance to carry on and use it on the road. Um, the service history comprises of both the service book and some service bills and receipts. So um, I'll just uh, run through what I've got here. The service book um, supplying dealer was Ford Thorn. Uh, the original plates are on the front and the back of the car. Ford Thorn at uh, 11, 24, 33. Uh, and there's a big jump to 80 in 2009. That's a nationwide auto centre. There's bound to be services in there, probably covered by the receipts here. Another one at 100k in 2011, a Halford Zorta Centre at 97, which, uh, hang on a second, what have we got going on here? Next service due, sorry, my mistake, I'm reading the wrong bits out. Uh, next mileage, 80k, then 88k, 97k, and 105. The Halford Zorta Centre replaced the cam belt there at £284, and there's the receipt for it there, Halford Zorta Centre. The date was the 23rd of July 2012, and uh, it was 200 and odd pounds for the cam belt, two, nearly 300 quid, 264 pounds, and the whole bill then for that big service was 664 pounds, 69 pence. So the next person is going to get the benefit of all that. And there was another bill there, 229 pounds. That was a service done, uh, dated July 2011, so that was the year previous. And those brake pads again, July 20, uh, 2009. Uh, 2009 again, £375. Pounds. That was uh, an MOT, some front brakes, discs, etc. 
So certainly plenty of money spent on this car. Another £200 bill there uh, back in 2007. And another one here, 2792. So the gentleman has spent money on the car, which is good to see. We've got all the old MOTs to verify the mileage. And we do have two keys for the car. So that's what I like to see. A nice bunch of bills and receipts. A cam belt, not done that long ago. And V5 and MOT. Right, moving into the car then. So um, standard wind-up windows in the back. Three inertia wheel belts, three headrests, and a pretty tidy interior there actually. Map pockets in the back of the seats, all good. Opening the door up, uh, you can see we've got a sort of slightly sporty st steering wheel, black cloth trim, driver seats in pretty good order. So the pedal rubbers, we'll just jump into the car and it's been fitted with an aftermarket Kenwood Hi-Fi system with a CD player. Let's just start her up so we've got all the lights going on as they should and all the lights go out as they should. The engine sounds absolutely yeah, perfect, yeah. to be brutally honest. The brakes, the clutch, the clutch is actually very nice indeed. It feels absolutely perfect. Uh, all the gear change is good and I've driven this car about 25-30 uh, miles. It drives absolutely spot on. The locking wheel nuts are there as well. So there's the radio front and there's the old tax disc which ran out in January. Uh, Ford Thorn as well, so all Ford Thorn right the way through, there's a couple of airbags and it's a tidy place, it's a good useful tool this, the 1.6 it's got the electric windows as well zoom up and down, it's got the tinted glass, both sides work fine right, I should imagine that would make a nice little car for somebody to go on with, a family, with a dog etc so I'll leave you with that shot, thanks very much for watching we'll speak to you soon, bye bye